What's up guys, today we're going to be checking out the Wimius K9. I want to thank them for sending this out and sponsoring this video. So let's go ahead and check this out. I'm really excited. This one has Netflix certification on it, so it is certified. And then it also has Dolby Atmos. Uh, you also have 4K, Wi-Fi 6, Bluetooth. Uh, it's native uh, 700 ANSI. And then we also have the Auto Keystone. And you also do have 7,000 plus applications as well too. So um, let's go ahead and check this one out. All right, so one of the first things in the box is the iOS. It's a screencast device. It's a dongle, basically. And you can go ahead and plug this up if you use iPhone. I'm going to be using Android, so I'm not going to need that. But it's nice that they put it in there. All right, so we do have a remote controller. And this is actually a remote that's not super basic. So most projector remotes are very basic. This has your Netflix button, your YouTube button, Amazon Prime button, web browser on here, uh, your focus minus, you know, all the essential buttons on here. So that's really nice. And let's see what kind of batteries they take. Okay, cool. All right. We get a microfiber cloth, a blue one, which is really nice. I actually really like this color. And then, of course, we get the HDMI and our power cable. So let's go ahead and get the projector out. All right, boom. Very nice. I really like the look of it as well, too. All right, we got our lens cap on here. You can see the autofocus. It's native 1080p, but like I said, you can watch 4K content on here. It's our power button, vents, and let's go to the back of here. All right, so we have our Ethernet. We have two USBs, two HDMIs, the IR blaster you can see in the headphone jack, and that's pretty much it. So this one doesn't have any controls, so we're going to be to use a remote. Alright guys, we went ahead and booted the projector up and you saw how fast the auto keystone was. And then you are greeted by this home screen menu right here as well. And just, you know, briefly, just look at the clarity of the projector. Very good color on here as well too. And um, yeah, so you just signed into Wi-Fi and you pretty much have access to all of your big major applications like YouTube, Netflix, and then there's an app store and then there's a browser on here as well too, uh, which is really nice. Um, so you kind of don't have to set up anything, you know, for most people, I am gonna set up my, my phone with it, uh, but just as a projector itself, you know, you can pretty much just go into it and you don't have to worry about, you know, connecting your iPhone or Android device uh, if you don't want to. All right, so on your phone, you're just gonna go to your screencast and you just pull it up on the projector. And um, we're just gonna do Samsung desktop support and it'll pretty much, you know, find it. So you can see smart projector, start Samsung Dex, and then boom. All we're gonna do is uh, grab our remote controller and press okay. So very, very easy. It really, it's very straightforward. All right, so we got Samsung desktop support booted up here. And like I said, the best thing about this projector is that it is certified to work with Netflix, you know, right out the box. And on other projectors that does not have the certification, when we pulled up Netflix, it would be blocked. But on here, we can just actually go straight into Netflix. And let me turn this down a little bit. I can't play too much of it because of copyright, but you guys can see, I just come into it. Let me turn it down. And you can see, look at that picture. Super, super clear. Looks really, really good, guys. No latency issues or anything like that. I'll turn the volume up a little bit. All right, so we do have Dolby Atmos speakers on here, and I got the speakers up, and we'll go ahead and max it out, but let's go ahead and hear what it sounds like at a pretty high volume.
Yeah, so the speaker quality actually sounds very, very good. So I'm pretty impressed with it for the most part. Uh, the clarity on here is really good. It sounds way better than I would say like 90% of speakers. All right, so next I do want to test out PUBG. You can see I have it running here on the S21 FE and uh, just to check out the latency on here. Now, if you plug it up to HDMI, of course, you can expect pretty much zero you know, latency, of course. I want to see how this does on here. And it's actually pretty smooth, so you guys can see. It's definitely playable. And again, we're at a pretty high graphic, so anything else like Anything that's kind of light, like I'll show you guys like Subway Surf. And right here as a game like Subway Surf, you can see we're able to play pretty well too. So overall, I really like it. I really like the color on here. It's very vibrant as well. As you guys can see, the picture is super, super clear. You guys can just see that. So overall, I'm really happy with this projector. It being certified Netflix and having actually a very good speaker set up. Um, honestly, you don't even really have to put external speakers on here. It's a very clear and good amount of bass. So really like the product. Be sure to let me know what you guys think and I'll catch you guys in the next one.